Looks like fun. One, two, buckle my shoe. Woo! Woo! It's good. It's good. Let me into my zone. Let me, let me into my zone. Uh, let me into my zone. Please don't let me into my zone. Uh, let me into my zone. Let me, let me into my zone. Uh, let me into my zone. Please don't let me in. All right, good morning, everybody. Good morning. Today is day two of our Utah ski road trip. And on today's video, we're gonna be up here skiing at Ulta. I haven't been at Ulta in about two years, so I'm really excited to be back up here. Looks like it's gonna be snowing throughout the day and it's kind of giving us fresh reloads pretty much all afternoon. The wife is also gonna be joining me today and she's never even been up to Ulta before, so I'm really excited to see what she thinks of the resort, but so pumped to be back up here. Once that was the day. Let me into my zone, please don't let me into my zone. Let me into my zone, let me, let me into my zone. Let me into my zone, please don't let me in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gonna play that, take you down, I'ma say that. Money me a couple dollars, telling you now this payback. So I take that, ask them now, we'll save that. I've been going to the top and I got what they not, so I know that they hate that. But I'm on now, all these names gonna go now. And all these names gonna take what I did and they twist and they worse till I fall out. But I know that, so I keep what I'm doing cause I own that And I stay in the lab and I kill everything But I don't ever move, I'm a code at So don't, I'm gone, find me back in my home I'm working like so much, they swear I had me a clone Can't answer my phone now, just leave it there that tone Ballin' can't beat me up cause I'm back in my zone now Cause I'm back in my zone now Ballin' can't beat me up cause Woo! I'm back in my zone now I sound a lot better than I am, I actually really suck so this can be real funny if I... You got it bro Woo! It's good! It's good! Please don't let me in Please don't let me in my zone I just need some time on my own All these people trying to get a conversation You can conversate to that tone uh, I got up on that throne, yeah So I'm never alone, yeah All these people trying to box me in I'm Mayweather, it's on, yeah Now they ask where I'm at Making hits that line back I'm MJ, I'm 2-3, man I just need some time back I'm zoned in like defense My life gone, no recess But I live my best one So I got no regrets I'm gone, I'm gone Finally back in my home I'm working like so much They swear I had me a clown Can't answer my phone now Just leave it there that tone Ballin' can't beat me up Cause I'm back in my zone now Cause I'm back in my zone now Back in my zone now Ballin' can't beat me up Cause I'm back in my zone now Looks like fun. One, two, buckle my shoe. Woo! Back in my zone now. Let me in my zone. Let me, let me in my zone. Uh, let me in my zone. Please don't let me in my zone. Uh, let me in my zone. Let me, let me in my zone. Uh, let me in my zone. All right, gang, so far Savannah and I are off to an awesome day out here in Alta. This has honestly got to be a top three all-time day for Utah for me because it's just coming down like crazy right now, and I don't think it's going to stop until actually tomorrow. We're just having a little snack next to the Alps restaurant that's actually just at the base of the Supreme Lift and right across from the Sugarloaf Lift. So if you're kind of caught in between two of them, this is a really nice spot to come and you can just kind of hang out outside or inside, but you cannot bring your own picnic inside. So if you do like we did, we just came outside, sat at one of these tables. I didn't do yesterday's video justice. I mean, I know the overcast was bad, but the goggles that I was using just didn't have a good enough low light lens on them. So this morning, before we actually came to the mountain, I stopped at a little shop and just kind of got some cheapo lenses. And these ones, honestly, for the day that we're having have been absolutely perfect. We're gonna finish up some snacks here, jump back on the list for you guys, but all in all, having a great day. She's always gotta do something in my camera shots. My wife. 
crushing it. to do her first traverse. So we made it back to the Collins lift and are actually just gonna go underneath and then go across to, I think it's like the Highline Traverse. Um, and then try to do some of those black runs that go back down to the base of Ulta. But she's never done one of these before. And I don't feel like boot packing really too much, but I think uh, a couple of locals that just told us we can kind of go in front of the Collins lift and then make our way over. And we should be able to find a couple shoots. So let's go explore. This is a wide spot for you if you want to go in. Look at that girl, like nothing. All right, she's in and she's safe. I'm gonna see what else is available. Oh God. A lot of rocks. Okay, so I followed this ridge for maybe like three, four hundred yards and actually just saw a couple guys go into a few of the tree runs below me and it looks pretty good from here. So I think I'm just going to kind of tackle this run right here. I know there's definitely a lot more difficult runs and shoots kind of a little further down the traverse, but I think I'm just going to go in here, go back to the Collins lift and see what we got. Let's go in here. Woo. Not bad. Not bad. A little crusty underneath, but <laughs> snow is so good, you guys. Just spoiled. Okay. All right. <laughs> Let's go. So good. Cruising. Knocking off new train at Ulta. What's well, better? guys Vaughn and I just started wrapping up the day and heading back to the car needless to say we had an awesome day overcast is just crazy right now and pretty much visibility is at an all-time zero but definitely one of the highlights of the day was going along that high traverse off the Collins lift and doing a couple runs off of there just glad the wife could join me out here this weekend and get some new turns under her belt and it was the first day out in Alta for her I think she had a good time all around. Gonna probably head back to our hotel, get some good food, 
go chill in the hot tub for a little bit and then plan to be back up here on a Saturday. We'll see how Little Cottonwood Canyon looks then, but the last time we tried to come up here on a weekend at Snowbird on a powder day, it took us five hours to get up here. Hopefully the traffic isn't as bad tomorrow as last time. Well, thank you guys so much again for watching. See you boot in a boot. We'll see you guys in the next one.